beautiful blue sky out today, guys. What's going on? Look at this. So I woke up this morning and it was downpouring sideways. Then 10 minutes later, the sun came out. It was like perfect. So picking up a truck today down here in Windsor. Brought the flatbed. And guess what it is? Bum, bum, bum. 2500 gasser. So let's get her loaded up. Get out of here. Guess we need a battery to run this thing. Gold Magnum. It's quite the unit. Standard work truck. Bet she'll jump. See if she'll run. <laughs> Not yet. A little more juice. Third time's a try, charm. <laughs> Almost half tang in there. We got the Timmy's. I hit up A&W for breakfast. It's basically tradition now. Every time I leave winter, I go for A&W breakfast and then get a coffee. So, sorry for the wind noise. It's super windy here, but we are loaded up. Look at that. That's just that's just a great photo. Ford pulling the Dodge standard. All right, let's get home. Brad and Hill are coming over, and then we're gonna wreck some stuff. We're not wrecking the Dodge today, but we're gonna wreck something. So. Maybe we can get that other Dodge going. See if there's time. Swung by the old reserve here to fill up with some cheap gas. I can't believe how much it's gone up. I'm pretty sure I paid 70 cents a liter back in the winter. That was a buck 13. Holy. Made her back. Ho oh, oh, ho, this thing. She's a little heavy, you know. The old f 150 squatting a little, but deep squats, great shots. Anyways, we got, uh, Mr. Mr. McNine here. Yo! Hey. Oh, you brought your, you brought the drone too. I got yeah, we double drone it. We're double droning. You want to double drone? I'll double drone if you're thinking of double drone. Let's double drone. Now let's all take a second here to make fun of Brad Chevy for breaking down the other day. Okay, it was in it was it started 50% of the time. <laughs> There's a starter issue with these, apparently. It's time to trade her in though. <laughs> Isn't it a 2018? Is it a 17? 17. Oh, okay. She's getting old. Yeah, it's 19 now. I'd trade it in. It's got 33,000K on it. And the starter went. Yeah. Who typical, wants it? Who typical wants Chevy, it? eh? I'll give you a good deal. Yeah, I should have got Ford. Good luck negotiating with me, but I'll give you a good deal. <laughs> uh, so, Brad, what do you think of the truck here? This one? No. Well, this Dodge is nicer than the Ford pulling it. But I should have threw the Ford on the trailer and drove the Dodge. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. It cost you twice as much in gas. Yeah. Anyways, you guys will never guess what I paid for this thing. Definitely was not ten grand. I traded two cases of beer. Here you go, Brad. Good beer. Nice. That's my weekly pay here, guys. If you guys wondering what I get paid, boom. all the money. So, anyways, um, yeah, we traded two cases of beer. Uh, Justin's girlfriend Emily, her father actually gave us this truck. So thank you to him. Um, Definitely, these things are definitely hard to find. It's not a diesel, it's a gasser. So it's nice to have pickup trucks. I know you guys love the pickup trucks down there. It's just, uh, it's not uh, four by four, I don't think. So we're gonna rip it around. I don't know what he's doing back there. 10 grand at Rockstar, so I get paid per week. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go down the track, unload this. We'll do a few laps and then we're gonna cause some other ruckus. I'll drive this. Yeah, you can take that down. Have a step <laughs> I love your bibs. Like it's so hot today and you're wearing bibs. I don't want that chump change. <laughs> <laughs> oh Brad. Alright, let's head down. There you go. There we go. Freeman excavate and surface. Come to your backyard, plumb your pipes, whatever you need done. I'm getting one of these made. You're a mag. Not with Freeman. <laughs> Got those tires pumped up. Wow. We always throw a little bit uh, extra PSI in you the tires. Always need a little extra. Always need a little extra. 
because these tires like to pop off the beads. If you read the fine print in the manual at the bottom, it says always use a little extra. <laughs> it got dark again. Who? It got dark again. You did? No, I didn't. Oh. Hey, this got dark. Huh. So for a little cruise. Let's go! Speed it up! You're taking forever! This can't get from point A to point B anywhere quick nowadays. Looks like we got a storm rolling in though. You're clear! Yeah. That's plumbing service. <laughs> Ready to go. All right, this thing's gonna unclog your drains. <laughs> <laughs> Don't plumb your pipes. So anyways, we got the NoCo GB 150. Let's see if this thing starts. Oh, like a charm. 80% of the time, every time. Rever up there. I don't even want to stand near that. God, it's gonna blow. <laughs> what is that little leak? That's the turbo. Yeah, right. There's no air box on it. It's just stuck throttle down. <laughs> this is gonna be good. Oh god. <laughs> Did it just start high like that? Yeah. Oh my god. This thing is going to just... Throttle stuck. Just drop it. I don't need sunglasses right now. No. Alright. What'd you do here, Brad? Nothing. Let's get her off. Let's just do it. That might have been just... Oh, you got the you got the seal stuck in the old garb there. In the intake. That's what it is. That's why... Here, go go hit the gas. Alright. Shut her down. Don't start it. Just, just hit the don't gas. Don't tell me how to... I got my high-vis vest on here. You know I know what I'm doing. There. Boom. Now start, now start it. <laughs> oh my god, we're mechanics. Hey, this little guy is stuck in the intake. We're going to cut that short and just do a little how-to video. Oh. <laughs> All right, let's unload it. OK. The old turbo dodge. What do you think, Brad? I'll direct you back. Just keep an eye on the vest. Okay. Here, I gotta do a little burn out on the trailer. All right. Let me know when I'm on. You're not there yet. You're pretty close.
say that rain's gonna pass real quick. She was kind of spit. She kind of is spitting, but not enough to notice it. Anyways, we got the. Are you taking a pee? A brand new strap, Safety eh? First, that was brand new. I think it went through eight straps last year. Yeah. It was so cheap. So we uh, we jumped the Dodge Durango here the other day. She was a good jump. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Unfortunately, YouTube demonetized it or didn't even monetize it because what was I doing? Harmful acts in an unprofessional environment. That's the first time they saw that. Yeah. Yeah, I posted the video twice, long one and a short one, and they didn't demonetize the short one. So I'm really confused, but whatever. I'm not gonna fight it. Whatever. Still got views. So, anyways, that's the worst spot to hook it up, Brad. I'll get it. No, no, I get you, it. You want to put it on the window frame? Oh, you're. Oh, you're just gonna. Okay. Oh, I just stretch my back. Oh, <laughs> stretch the old calves. All right, let's see if we can flip this over. And if we do flip it over, we're gonna try and start it. Fingers crossed. Oh, here comes the rain. Here comes the rain. And if it does start, we're not gonna jump it again. We're gonna try and blow up the engine. Unless it drives straight, then maybe we'll jump it again. See if there's time. Thing we got the other Dodge, Rad's plumbing service. Anyways, so it didn't have a hitch pin, but there, oh, easy, Brad. But there is a clevis here, so I looped it through there, and physics that should work. All right, what do you think, Brad? Well, we'll see what happens. Brad's towing service now. Hey, easy, easy. Yeah, that's good. Okay. See if we can yank the Dodge with the Dodge. Whoa, don't flip her too hard. Oh yeah, that front tire's blown, so we can't jump it again anyway. Now to see if she starts again. This whole thing's twisted, eh? Oh my God. She had a bit of a crumple. Looks like the whole end bent up. Like, look at the roof, how it caved in like that. Right on. I think we bent the frame on this one. Look at the roof. Oh yeah, she's buckled. <laughs> you should have tucked the airbags out before they went off. All right, Is let's this see. Is waterproof? Yeah, that's, that's, you're waterproof. I know. You ain't made of sugar. I know. Are the keys in here? Oh yeah. Yeah. All right, let's see if we can start her. Actually, scrap that. We're gonna do some more fun stuff with that, that Dodge real quick. And then, and then we'll do this Dodge in a separate video. If it would stop freaking raining. Stop freaking raining. Hey, let's throw, let's throw that junk in the old Jeep over there. Let's throw all the junk in the Jeep. That junk in your trunk. Just open the gate, back her up. She'll slide right in. <laughs> slide her right in. That flipped over pretty easy, eh? Well, it's all with the driver. Like. <laughs> I didn't think you were gonna make it because you were spinning in all that mud. Then it caught. Where, I knew where it was gonna grip. This whole time, eh? This whole time, every time. 80% <laughs> of the time, every time. All right, let's get rid of that junk. Brad never gets stuck. Doing a little flexing right now. There you go. Also, the dozer is coming this Friday, so we're going to move the jump closer, bigger, higher, faster. Full sendable. And we'll be jumping cars right over this mound. Just a little bird. Out. Are you excited for the bigger jump, Brad? Oh, I cannot wait for the bigger jump. <laughs> Oh man, we need to get rid of this Jeep. It's been here for a long Where time. Where is this wheelbarrow gonna go? <laughs> well, we can throw everything else up. Oh then. yeah. There you go. No problem, Bob. Still good for work. Oh yeah. Nice truck. Not a bad. Oh. Not a bad. Not too bad at Not all. Not a bad. 
Anyways, that was fun. We're gonna wrap this up for now. Next oh. video. Oh, hey. Oh, hey. hey. No. Just talking. Just talking. Uh, next video, we're gonna try and get the Durango going. Hopefully it goes. And then we're gonna put bullets in the engine. Drain the oil out and then put bullets. Let me guess who's revving it up. <laughs> yeah, probably this guy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you guys as always for watching. Get excited. We got lots more cars coming. I'm picking up actually another one tonight and then another one tomorrow. I'm going full Freeman Scrapyard. Full oh, Freeman. So I think like, we need to jump this G6 today. Like it, make it fly like a G6. Hey, see if there's time. As long as the rain holds off, I'm in. We're good. Um, but for now, thank you guys. Check out the other videos. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you later. Bye.